when you stream other game, you need to have permission to do that. In this video, we're going to look at the trademark of Twitch. Twitch is not a company that creates games, but a lot of people stream their gameplay on Twitch. So we're going to look at the trademark of Twitch. I'm going to show you where you can find the trademark and how they register the trademark. So let's begin. First, we're going to look up uh, what is Twitch, what kind of company is it? And after that, we're going to look at what kind of trademark they register for their brand. So let's, look, let's go to Google, type Twitch. You see here Twitch, America Video Live Stream Service. So, so it's a company that provides live stream service. If you're playing a game, you can stream it on Twitch. A lot of people can do that. Even you can do that. So that's about Twitch. We're not going to go on their website because uh, it's unnecessary in this case. What we're going to do right now is we're going to go to the trademark search engine and look at the trademark of Twitch. So we are using TM View. Team Review is a search engine. I made a video about that, how you can use it to look for trademark of our company. So we're gonna go to the website and on the website, we're gonna look for the trademark Twitch. So you see, it is the home page of Team Review. So let's look for the trademark Twitch. So you see, this is the results. If we go down, we can see what is registered and what isn't. 191 registration. So for Twitch, let's see what is registered and what isn't. So you see the word is registered and the logo is also registered, you see that here. So, and if you look at here, some of them are reason registration, some of them are old. And what you're going to do is the application name. You see a lot of companies here, that's the name Twitch. But here, these are the Twitch companies. So if you press this, you'll find a trademark that uh, registered for Twitch, for a Twitch company. I do not know how the structure look like and so that's why I'm not going to look at the application name most of the time when you do know the structure of a company because most of the time they have a mother company and a daughter company you can find them in a lot of countries but in this case we're not going to do that we're just going to look at the trademark in another video I will explain business structure and how you can find out what those structures are and how you can use that in your advantage but for now we are going to focus only on trademark so we have this trademark we're gonna look at it there's another one black interesting for the same class when you look for trademark look for things that are similar so that's that's the best thing why because sometimes um, if it's similar that means the brand has something to say to you and when a brand has something to say to you you know what the goal is especially for big companies if you have a small company and you want to register a trademark try to keep a pattern so if you register this like this in Mexico, do it also in other countries. So yeah. So if you look at this Twitch, we have another one Twitch here, but this is a logo, not interesting. And let's see. You need to look at the here you have one in Japan. Let's see what it is. And then let's go to the next one. While we're waiting for the next one, we're gonna look at here. See Twitch, register. The day. This is Mexico. This is Spanish. I think yeah, Espanol. Yeah, that's Spanish. The Twitch, the logo, and 38. I think for live stream services. I do not know, but let's try to translate and see what happens. So if we press English, it will translate audio electronic. So 38 is a pattern that they have, and 38 is the best way to for Twitch to register. Interesting incorporation. Twitch is an um, is a part of Amazon, but you do not see that here. That's why the structure will talk about it in another video. So this is part Twitch. Let's look at another one. This is also Espanol, the same, but then uh, black also Mexico, if I'm correct. Yep, black. So you have um, purple and black. Interesting. And then you have this one, Twitch. This is in uh, Japan. GP Japan representative. And they have it here for more, for more classes, 9, 28, 38, 38 is the most important one, you can see that here, but let's try to translate it, let's see what it says, mm, yeah, it couldn't be translated, so yeah, thing is you need to learn this katana in order to understand it, so we don't have that here, 
too bad we cannot translate it let's go back so in japan we cannot translate it let's look at other ones you have in india you have in brazil let's look at on this one is canada this one is new zealand so you see twitch big company and there is there in all in almost every country of the world that's interesting to see and when you see it you see 9 and 38 9 and 38 is important they have a certain pattern here see that here so when you register a trademark try to keep the pattern because when you have that it is to protect your trademark when someone uses it in another country so um this is for hats hoodies i think this is for merchandise they put it to um it's the last minute computer software broadcasting yeah but i do not see the the number mm. Interesting. I do not see the number. I see it's zero zero. Mm, I think maybe they use this to um to add things to the brand that is already registered. So let's look at this one. So you see, Twitch is an interesting company because they allow people to stream on their platform. But the thing is, the name is important. But the problem is that when you stream or the game. You need to have permission to do that and i do not know how the structure they work right now maybe they have a contract with a gaming company doesn't matter but um, they're doing a good job for now so you see trademark register let's look at the country uk so we have uh, figurative the logo is trademark so we see here the logo and here nine computer software broadcasting nice important 38 you see there's a structure and it's really nice but the thing is they just do broadcasting and not a lot of thing because those most people stream on the platform but um, if I'm correct Twitch is uh, but if I'm correct Twitch is part of Amazon I do not know a lot about that structure but it's for me it's interesting to look into it but um, yeah this is my um, review about Twitch you can find a lot of trademark in here you can see that all here yeah. if you look for trademark in your country what uh, what's registered for Twitch just look for your country if you want to know who the trademark holder is so what kind of company is a trademark holder Twitch is a trademark holder but you can look it here or you can go on a trademark when you have the trademark you can find the information in here it's that simple and that's how you can locate them so if someone sent you a letter with uh, there's um, a fragment in trademark just look the trademark up and see if it's correct or not and you can use the trademark engine that's all in this video if you have question about this video or you have question about trademark feel free to contact me on discord patreon or telegram if you have other questions feel also free to contact me if you're new to this channel feel free to subscribe and i will see you in the next video